a truck crashing into a Valley High home early this evening, trapping at least one person inside and leaking gasoline into the neighborhood. The damage a sight to see. ABC 10's Van 2 is there now where the difficult cleanup effort is underway. Van. Well, Luke, it took several hours, but crews have been able to remove the truck from the home here at the corner of Golden Field Way and Valley High Boulevard. You can see the hole has been boarded up now at the corner of this home, and you can see the metal uh, uh, siding on the house also ripped to shreds upon impact of this truck. Now, what makes this process a bit complicated? PG&E crews have to dig underground to that gas line to make sure that nothing is damaged Further. Now, earlier tonight, neighbors describe a loud boom followed by a cloud of dust rising into the air. They say there was so much of it, it wasn't until the dust settled that they realized the truck had crashed into the home. A woman screaming for, for help from one of the windows saying her husband was trapped inside before she jumped out of the window and first responders broke a window to rescue the man. Now, Sacramento police say the truck driver was known to have multiple felony warrants and had evaded a traffic stop, then leading officers on a brief chase before crashing into this home. We saw some lady got out the truck and started running, but then the, co uh, the cops pulled out their gun and then she came back. Now, the driver will be booked on those outstanding warrants, plus any charges related to tonight's incident. Now, as for the man who was trapped inside that home, the Sacramento Police Department tells us that he is in stable condition but may require surgery.